What is up, guys? It's Bolt98. And in this video, we're going to be talking about Modern Warfare 3 bringing hit markers with throwing knives, beta dates, and doors are coming back even on our older maps. Let's get right into the video. Getting a hit marker with throwing knives seems insane, but that is exactly what seems to be happening with Modern Warfare 3. But before we get into that, drop a sub right now. It takes two seconds. We are 94.8% of our viewers are not subscribed, so make sure you sub and hit that like button. If you decide not to subscribe, leave feedback down below on what I can do to better the content to make you hit the button next time. Anyways, let's get right into it. Talking about throwing knives, apparently a well-known leaker, hey I'm Alex, a recent social post, Hence, that throwing knives will have hit markers. Yes, yeah, so apparently he posted the melee weapon with a hit marker beside it, or a hit marker PNG beside it, meaning that we are going to be getting hit markers with our throwing knives. This is insane news because I don't know how this is going to work. It's kind of probably going to be like the Ninja Stars, but I mean, I don't know if this is a good way to go. I don't like dying right when I see someone, but then again, that is part of the throwing knife, so I understand. Regardless, this is going to be very controversial, and I can't wait to see what happens, but we won't know till the beta, which we do have dates for. Mark your calendars, folks, because we have dates for the beta, for the Modern Warfare 3 release, and of course, Season 1, when Modern Warfare 3 and Warzone combine. Yes, we have the dates. Here they go. The beta obviously coming out in October, release date being November 10th, and Season 1 coming out sometime in December. We only can expect for December 12th to be our season one integration of warzone and modern warfare 3 which would be super cool if we get that but we're not exactly sure it should be around the 10th or 15th so make sure you mark your calendars folks because you don't want to miss those and we will get more information and as we do i'll be dropping them let's get over to our maps yeah so apparently the remaster modern warfare 2 maps and modern warfare 3 will be the same scale as modern warfare 2 2009 however they will now have doors doors will be in modern warfare 3 even on our old gen maps, or our Modern Warfare 2 2009 maps, yes. So we will have the peek and the door option. I don't know exactly how this will work. I know, for example, some maps already have doorways, and they're just open. So maybe instead of them being open, now we'll actually have a peekable door there. So that is only option that I can think. I don't think they're opening the map up any more than they already have. So if the door wasn't open, the door is not going to be there. It does seem that we are also getting something else from 2009's Modern Warfare 2. We're getting the music. Yes, so the old day nostalgia is coming back. The composer is going to be coming back with Modern Warfare 2's uh, well, Modern Warfare 3 2023 having the same music from 2009 Modern Warfare 2. Now they don't say it's going to be the exact same music, but they do to an extent show that it is going back to the roots music wise and we should have that same theme we had back in 2009 which would be super cool and super nostalgic based um, and of course they'll add theme tracks and menu tracks like they have in Modern Warfare 2 but this is super cool to have it when we get into the game but yeah guys I'm super excited for Modern Warfare 3 let me know down below anything that you want to know or anything that could have been covered more in this video or let me know what you feel about hit markers on knives doors coming back and even the beta dates like let me know what you guys are expecting uh, I mean I'm really kind of on the fence about the throwing knife thing like I like it but I don't at the same time because I think it takes away from that you know that bit of action in Modern Warfare 2 2009 there was no hit marker so why are we implementing them now if you know what I mean I think it's more of a war zone thing but then again I don't know I don't really I don't like the throwing knife idea I think throwing knives should be left alone they are throwing knives that's what you use a throwing knife for but let me know your ideas down below and I'll see you in the next one guys peace out